Hey guys, this is my version of the old trick out of this world. Uh, just got a little bit of a variation. If you want a tutorial, just ask me and I will gladly make one. So the trick begins with me asking a spectator to pick any card that he or she likes. So they take out this card, free choice. Just remember it, place it over here, screw up the rest of the deck. They can show whoever else is watching. You know, they can sign it if they like, but say remember it remember it and it's at this point where I start talking about the mental connection that I have one that I've developed if I was to say to the spectator Ooh, is this card here black or red so they say black I say well you're wrong it's red say okay mm, what about mm, this one red again no it's black again Oops, sorry they said red doesn't matter <laughs> you get what I mean that's what I'm going to do I'm going to go through the deck, show you the back of the card, and you tell me whether you think it's a black card or a red card. And so, it's a black or red? Let's have to say red. Again, is it black or red? Black. Is it red or black? I'm just going to keep fast forwarding this. I'm going to fast forward through this. Uh, black, red, red. This is completely random. They say where, where they want the cards to go. Black, red, red. And at one point, I'll just stop and say, okay. I'm going to keep doing this, but at one point, probably around at this card, just leave this sticking face up, I will stop and switch things around. This is about halfway, that's why I stopped here. Uh, but I'll keep going for now. Is it black or red, the next card? So they say red. Is it black, red? So they say black. They keep going. Black, black, red. Whatever they want. Again, it's random. It does not matter. Red, red. And then we've got to this card. And... Up until this point, it's been embedded in your mind that this is the black pile because the black key card is here, and this is the red pile because the red key card is here. Um, so if I put this black card with the red pile, it would switch up this psychic system we have. So if we can still do it, this would just prove how strong this psychic connection is. Now hopefully I'm going to cut three times and get a red card. One, two, three, and mm, yep, I found a red card. Good guessing. So I'll put the red card here. Again, we're going to switch it up. So we do it again. Do you think this card is black or red? So they think it's black. Black. Red. Red. Black. Black. Whatever. Black. Black. Red. Red. Oop. Oh, we know it's red. Sorry, flipped over. Red. Black. Red. Black. Oop. That one's a mistake. Sorry. Yep. Black. Red. Black. And they do this with the rest of the cards. They can actually do this in their hands. They choose where it goes. I like to do this one. It's fun. I say, okay, you made one mistake here in this last pile. Touch a card. Say so they touch this one. Say, yep, see, it was a mistake. <laughs> and they put it. I, that's a little thing I like to do. It's funny. And at this point, I'll go, okay, now you've decided everything. We've got the red with the red piles and we've got the black piles. So let's have a look over here. I'll just straighten this up so you can see. Easier. I'm not doing anything shifty. Square the deck up. Sorry. And we'll spread them along. Okay, now. This is where the red key card is. Up until here. Everything above the black key card is in fact black. They are all black cards. Huh? That's pretty crazy. And again, underneath this red card, everything is, all these cards are, that's right, you guessed that they're all red. Okay, same thing with this side. Remember, they picked everything, so they'll be flipping out. This is the red. Sorry. I guess, sorry. Okay, again, look, I don't know if you can see this. This is the other key card. Up until... The top, they are all red. You picked it, not me. And again, this black key card, all the cards are black. Now that's pretty crazy, but you'll notice over here I made one mistake. At the red key card, they're all red, except one card. And I believe that that was your card that you selected at the beginning of the trick. That's it, guys. I hope you liked it. It's a nice little trick I like to do. I've fooled a lot of people with it. Uh, if you want a tutorial again, just ask and thank you.